Hey folks, this is Ben Gessel. I'm just um, here at the Fred Meyer, I should say, Fred Meyer here. Oh, you can't really see the sign. Fred Meyer here on, uh, in Seattle, kind of in Lake City, North Seattle area, closer to North Seattle. Um, anyway, um, I just want to make a quick video here. I have a little bit of time before teaching um, music lessons today. I want to talk about some of the additional thoughts I've had about the um, YouTube series Cobra Kai, but also I've been thinking about um, some things more in depth. I don't know if I'll get to all of them in this video regarding um, philosophies of martial arts. I'll try to get to some of this at least. And so it's a great show. Again, I, I just I love it. It brings up brings so many things. It's it's like everything you wanted to see. In the original, you know, Karate Kid movies, but so everything you want to see, but you didn't see. It's it's like <laughs> it's it's coming up in Cobra Kai. It's touching. It's hitting on all the right notes. It's hitting everything right. It's just doing everything right. I just love it. I love it. I love it. I love it. But what I wanted to talk about particularly was the Cobra Kai philosophy of life versus Miyagi Do, which I know it's been beat to death and everything. But I, I want you to think really hard about. That concept of striking first, striking hard, no mercy, sir. <laughs> if you strike first in a competition, a tournament or something, or some some kind of organized fight, like a like a, a professional fight, it isn't always the best um, the best strategy. Not really. It doesn't really matter, actually. It's kind of a bit beside the point in, in a way. But if you're talking about a real fight in real life, where at least among adults it's illegal, illegal pretty much, um, striking first and striking hard means that in, ma in many cases, most cases, at least for us private citizens, or as, I don't know, for all, all of us that are vulnerable to police discipline, law, and order, if you strike first and you strike hard, and it's something where it's unprovoked, yeah, you're going to be in trouble a lot. So that's 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 the obvious thing to get out of the way. If somebody pushes you and they start they start something, right? Or if you feel like somebody else instigated instigated a fight, and you're simply the one that struck, struck first after that, that's one of the other trains of thought. Which you know, so it's it's like oh. Self defense, or I was, they, they started it right. I was just striking first, like really hard. I knew how to strike. And so, you know, okay. It's just that, um, you know, again, in a real life fight, again, it's kind of like a little bit like a tournament or, you know, or it doesn't really matter in some respects. Obviously, if you have a much more powerful opponent, much, much more powerful guy, bigger guy, stronger guy, or skilled guy, or whatever, and he hits someone, it's going to probably do some damage. It might put that person out of commission, depending on the situation between the two people. But um, but in many cases, it really isn't that f the most effective thing to do. And we're talking about it, when we're talking about a real fight, of course, it's actually illegal, right? So the person, so it's, and then, of course, no mercy is the, is the kicker. Whenever you show no mercy, no mercy in real life, and it, whether it's a real fight or it's something, some other kind of whatever, um, well, you can be successful, you can win at things, but in the long run, it's never going to serve you well because people will come to see you as not a person they can do business with or not a person that they want to have any kind of association with if you don't show any mercy. Um, and of course, all this is very different from Yagi Do, where they stress using karate as defense only, right? And many other things that don't involve striking really hard with lots of power and things like that. I don't know. It's a little bit more about um, being very. Um, yeah, balance and being very coordinated and that sort of thing 
flexible, certainly some power, sure, but um, it's just a different kind of thing. And this whole, this because there's a lot of different, you know, sides to this. There's, there's the morality of fighting still, there's the and law and order. You, you know, I don't know if you guys realize, but if everybody struck first, struck hard, did have any mercy, we might have a breakdown of law and order, right? It might break down law and order, but um, it takes a lot of guts to to actually strike someone that's not that's someone, someone that's more physically capable. It always takes a lot of guts, so that's why a lot of people say, you know, Cobra Kai is like, yeah, and a lot of people see Cobra Kai kind of whole approach as being more like MMA, for instance, and. Okay, but you still have to have a lot of Miyagi. Miyagi does those stuff going on in MMA too. You know, it's 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 fighting is being a good fighter is um, it's all that stuff. It's 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 every everything. Um, of course, um, of course, you know, like you can talk about effectiveness of different martial arts. You can, but. That's different. That's somewhat different. Somewhat, somewhat of a different subject. Um, but, uh, but yeah, I mean, like, like I understand, like, some all that sort of thing. I have to keep this video again to a kind of a minimum. I have to cut out here in a second. But, um, but again, it, I want to focus mainly on the, the Cobra Kai philosophy again versus Miyagi Do. And a lot of folks are very behind Cobra Kai. I think what a lot of people want to see happen is Johnny uh, stand up to Crease and say no more, you know. Maybe ally himself with, with uh, Daniel Russo, but, um, but a lot of people do like the, the fearlessness of the Cobra Kai thing and whatever. That's, you know, it's just that when you, when you take that, those philosophies to the extreme, you, that's where Cobra Kai is the group that is not good right it's bullish it's intimidating it's wrong and everybody knows this you know um so i wanted to at least make this video i'll catch you guys later take care bye